Hello everyone, today we have two amazing guests joining us. Without further delay, let's start with our interaction. Hello everyone, today we have the privilege of interacting with two amazing women. They are none other than Analia Zumomi, the founder of Analia Beauty, and we have Dr. Lika with us. She is the founder of Lee's House of Aesthetics. Thank you so much for giving us your time. Please tell us about yourself and your profession. Hi, good morning. My name is Dr. Lika. Um, I'm the founder of uh, Lee's House of Aesthetic. I'm a medical esthetician and um, I do cosmetic uh, procedures. Thank you. Hi, good morning everyone. I'm Analia Zamomi. I'm the founder and director at Analia Beauty, Makeup Analia Academy, and I'm also a professional brand makeup artist. We are so glad to have you here. Can you please tell us uh, how do you think we can challenge societal norms uh, that limit women's potential in our society? Uh, I think because I'm from the beauty industry and that is women dominated, so I would say uh, I have as not like I have not faced any such challenges, but I'm sure Dr. Lee has faced challenges being from that sector. So yeah. she had a story to tell actually. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> actually, um, I, before I came to this industry, I was working under the government of Nagaland. So I was a medical officer in district hospital. So um, even us sitting as a doctor with our apron and a male nurse standing and assisting us, they would address them as sir and as a sister. So our society find it difficult to accept women as ma'am or doctor. But they accept other, um, the males, even if they are nurse or attendant, they address them as sir. So those are the few things that I have uh, um, encountered in my professional life. That is very sad. Yeah, very sad actually. So if you could give any message to the younger women, what would it be? I think uh, to stay focused, dedication and hard work, and always uh, trust in the Lord because uh, he, he knows the plan before we do. So in anything, if you want to succeed in life, is to put our trust in the Lord and believe in ourselves. And there's nothing, uh, you know, nothing can be against us if God is for us. So I believe in that. Yeah, I think uh, for me, I would say follow your passion. Obviously, with your passion, like it comes dedication, consistency, and perseverance. Thank you Thank so you. much, and I wish you all the best. Thank you so Thank much. You. That is all we have for now. Keep watching for more updates.